I just had a realization that I noticed that I'm actually really afraid to be seen. I've been just like analyzing that. Like I just don't really feel so much. But right now I just analyze myself and I can feel emotions. I know what's up. I mean, I'm I'm glad that I can like analyze my emotions but it's also really weird because I'm not used to that anymore it makes so much sense that I'm scared to be like fully seen to be fully acknowledged because back in the days I didn't feel seen at all and I also wanted to hide and to not be seen at all and so now I still always like kind of hold back because I don't wanna, I don't know, come across as weird or too much or I don't know. So I kind of like act or like play a role a lot of the times or like I'm just like a lower percentage of what I usually would be kind of. I'm just thinking about that all. I just have so many realizations. And it also that's also why I wanted to push away the transition thing because that would make me visible and I'm actually scared to be seen as who I am like on so many different levels with so many different people and even with myself like I try to push things away from me that I don't know I don't know I just wanted to tell you that I got some emotions back also I made this today with my friend and I have it here on my phone and it's so nice to like play with it so I'm really glad that I made this <laughs> I just wanted to say that I got new glasses and I love them very much they're in dark green I have this plant here which you don't really see it's my philodendron melanochrysum um, let me show you here that's what we've been working with and I feel like it has some like root rot, root rot or something, I don't know. So I'm gonna like check the roots and maybe plant it differently. And I was also thinking maybe, just maybe, to cut it and make it smaller, like propagate it, kind of. I cut it. I just cut it. Oh no, why did I cut it? That is how it looks now. So small. It is Sunday today and I kind of almost had a meltdown. I don't know if it was a panic attack or a meltdown, maybe both. Then I went showering and it really helped. And I just wanted to show you what my greenhouse is looking like and like the plants that are growing super fast and i'm not used to that so I'm, i just want to show you like this plant that i have here before it was really like not green at all anymore now it just looks so much better and then here from my allocation there's a new leaf coming here this propagation this leaf is like growing this leaf is unfurling also super fast a new leaf is coming there as well so far it's been so good i really love my greenhouse cabinet <laughs> and also this light here i in the video that in the last video where i built the cabinet and everything i only used the glue that came with the wall mounts but it actually doesn't work for me so I asked my dad and he helped me to secure it here. I haven't been outside for a walk in like so long. I think the last time well, no, actually not. Well, no, actually, yes. <laughs> Hello. It 
It is Thursday today and I had a therapy session and it went really well. I just want to know if like the lack of feelings that I feel, if that's just how it is right now. And because it is influenced by some stuff that I'm coping with or I don't know, like, you know, I don't know if it's a mental health problem or if it's just my new normal state like if that's just how i am right now and i don't know but i mean i still want to treat myself with compassion and allow myself to if i feel things to then explore these things and if not that i i don't know i maybe have to learn to not stress myself when i don't feel a lot of emotions and i'm talking like in general like any kind of emotions because I'm just used to feeling so much and I'm used to also really diving deep into these feelings and putting on my headphones, listening to music and just laying in, laying in bed and like thinking and feeling. I used to be that kind of person but now I just don't feel so much. And maybe that's also totally normal and fine for some phases in your life to just be in, like in a neutral kind of state. I don't know. But I mean for sure also the medication is influencing me and the possibility that I might start tea soon also is influencing me in a way that I, I don't know, I'm maybe coping because I don't know really what to expect and so I don't want to have like my hopes up again because last time my blood work didn't come out how it's, I don't know, supposed to be or yeah. I don't know if you can see, but they're actually green. And the coolest thing about these glasses <laughs> is they have glasses on the glasses. Like, how cool is that? And then tomorrow I have another phone call with my endo doctor, endocrinologist. And we're gonna talk about um, my progesterone because that got checked up again and some other stuff i don't know if my thyroid also got checked i don't really know what exactly got checked but some things got checked and if my blood work is fine then i could start testosterone i really don't know what to expect today is the day of the phone call um i am scared let's just be honest i'm really scared I already have stomach pain and the anxiety is rising up. I mean, I still have a bit over an hour time till I have the appointment, but I I can't do anything else today. I just had the call and I just wanted to say <laughs> that I had the appointment. It was scheduled between like one and two. And now it's three and I was like waiting for like two hours sitting in this chair doing literally nothing and I was so so anxious and I didn't know what to do and everything and when I already gave up that she's gonna call me she called me and at first she misunderstood me because I don't know she was stressed or something and then she was like I'm sorry like and then she told me that I can start taking testosterone and I don't know, I've been just crying out of relief because I've been like waiting for this moment for so long and there always came something in between. It's just so much joy that I feel and so much relief and like literally all the weight is like going off my shoulders kinda and I'm I'm gonna get the paper in the mail and still can't believe it really. I'm gonna dye my hair green today and I'm excited! Okay, I'm gonna dye my hair green now and then come back with a new hair color. I love this song, it's called Feel Good by Gorilla. Mwah, I love it. I don't know if I fully show my hair. I washed it once and it's already going out, so I'm kind of like, maybe I shouldn't have bought that kind of hair dye. I haven't been journaling in 
quite a while now I mean I have like two days ago was the last time I journaled but before that I haven't journaled in like two weeks or something and I also want to be more like mindful with my media consume because I have been just like addicted to TikTok lately I just received something in the mail it's the paper the prescription to sort tea and I think I'm gonna drive to the pharmacy with my bike also they misgendered me again <laughs> on the addressy thing they misgendered me which is like okay get ready with me to go to the pharmacy and pick up some tea okay I already have this shirt on which I feel really masculine which I don't know, I'm kind of feeling it today. And then I have these pants that I'm gonna switch in to. I don't know if I need anything else, I don't think so. I just went to the pharmacy and I got this um, number here. And I can pick it up at 4 p.m. I think it was. It's almost 6 p.m. right now and I was at the pharmacy and I picked up the tea juice. <laughs> I'm just so excited. I I don't know. I'm just really like in in a good mood because I have something here. It's this big. That is the thing. I mean, I I think I already know what it is. I'm just like, let's make an unboxing. Ooh, that is nice. <laughs> I got this Tesla gel like three times I'm gonna start tea on the 4th of June which is a nice date it is a nice day because if you add 6 plus 4 it's 10 <laughs> I'm just so excited these small packages <laughs> imagine I will do it like a Tesla gel ASMR. <laughs> I'm so excited. I wanna scream. You're gonna see me tomorrow in the morning. It is the morning. I just showered. First, I'm gonna wash my hands. <laughs> I'm excited, but I'm also scared. Oh my god. I can't believe it's happening. I'm gonna keep this and frame it. <laughs> And now they use like their wrists or something. I just put tea gel on my arm. Now I'm gonna wash my hands. I was like I got a lot of here, but I don't know. I'm gonna wash my hands now. I think it's already drying. First day on tea. <laughs> I'm gonna make a timer now on my phone okay i'm gonna wash my hands again you know i just imagine myself watching this video back and being like my voice was so high <laughs> or maybe not if you are auntie and you have you have knowledge please i need it because I, I i was maybe wrong how i applied it i mean i, I don't know I'm, I'm gonna make my bed now <laughs> i can't believe that it's my first day on tea and it, I mean, if I said, I'm already like, has my, voice has my voice changed? Am I feeling a little bit different? And no. Why do I feel like it's already changing so much in my body? Like, it's not possible. It is my third day on two now, and I'm like, is there a change? Or is there not? Because now, of course, I'm also hyper aware of like every little thing that might be a little bit different. Like, for example, that I was feeling really warm, but it was also temperature wise a bit warm. So <laughs> I don't know, it feels a bit dry. But I, I mean, that's just like what I'm putting now in my head. I don't know, like I want to see changes, but on the other side, because like the thought of waking up suddenly and having a completely different body and everything was a bit scary to me. Um, it's also kind of reassuring then that the changes not happen like after one day, you know? Yesterday, 
I was at a like flea market thing and I bought this snail here. It's a stem snail and I got it for one euro. It's not the best quality but I love the sound that it's making. So I'm just journaling right now and I'm I'm just like what? As if I'm on tea. As if I'm on tea. Like here, on my 2022 manifestations, I have a picture of testosterone. And I wrote that on the 1st of January. And now it's actually there. Wow.